Jay Tunnel here for uh, Beach Coming. Uh, this week we're on North Padre Island and uh, I was walking along here and saw some pretty cool stuff. So let's move it around here and let me show you what uh, we're finding today on the beach. Uh, if you can see these, these are what we call blue buttons. They're like little jellyfish. They don't sting. Nope. But they are all up in here. Another cool thing that we're finding are these storm snails, or sometimes they call them uh, violet snails. Okay. But notice, uh, and that might be too close, let's see, further back. But these are actually, they float around in the ocean and you see these bubbles they have on them? That's how they're able to float. And they also spit out this purple uh, dye that you can see I've got on my hands because I was picking them up earlier. Uh, but there's quite a few of those uh, uh, coming in right now. So if you're on the beach, Look how many of these blue buttons there are all along here. Let's see what else we can find. That's another uh, storm snail. Uh, oh, you all look at this. If you look real close, you see something that looks like grass. It is. This is uh, Halladuli, that's what we call it. But that's actually from back up in the bays. And then when it rains or it gets windy and the tides are coming out, it comes out the passes and then it starts washing up on the beach. And then a lot of people, and you'll, you'll see, sometimes this gets in a bunch of it on the beach, but this is, it's, uh, this is what we call the Serengodium. And this is also seagrass, but as it uh, breaks down over time, is in the sun, it starts bleaching out white. And how you know it's uh, uh, that Serengodium, it's round. So you go like this, and it uh, rolls in between your fingers. Let's see what else we got over here. <clears throat> oh, okay. We go up here to the higher tide line. I know y'all recognize this. Now this is the man of war, the famous man of war. Now these things you can you can touch the bubble top of it, but typically the the bottom part here is usually really long tentacles, and I mean they can stretch for you know 30 feet out, and so uh, you know always know whenever you get in the water if you see these things, you know know which way the current's going because these things will be. Um, you know their tentacles will be will be out behind them as this thing is floating in there and so these things hurt real bad their tentacles have the pneumatophores that are stinging cells and they'll go right into you they don't feel real good let's see uh, we've talked about these before y'all have seen a lot of these These are the coquina the donax uh, these are thousands you know you'll see thousands and thousands and they get they get down in the sand when they're alive and then uh, birds feed on them and, and stuff like that. A lot of good stuff today. Moderate amount of uh, sargasm. Look at this. What's this? This looks like a crab shell. Anybody know what that is? If you do, put it in the comments. Oh, look at this. Now this is broken. But this is uh, what we call a sailor's ear. But uh, you can see what it would look like. There's uh, real heavy ridges on it. It's a, a bivalve. So there'd be another side of it. So it'd kind of close up like this. Okay. Let's go down here. Sky is kind of wicked today. Let's see. Oh, now look at that. 
that is one of those air pockets from the storm snail but it's just the the cells it's got ha huh, let's come off of there cool all right well maybe that's all we got today which actually is a lot i mean i can't believe i mean look how many of these uh, uh blue buttons are down here and the storm snails. I mean, they're all over the place. That's pretty neat. Okay, I guess that's all we got for today. Uh, till next time, if y'all have anything that y'all want us to look at, let us know. We're working on a couple of different uh, beachcombing ones where we're actually going to go in the dunes and talk about some of the vegetation. Uh, we'd like to talk more about some of the birds. And when the water clears up, we actually want to go out into the water and show you what sea turtles are around the jetties and maybe even the, the pier and stuff like that. And so let us know if you have any ideas. These are all the ideas that y'all have given us that um, we're working on uh, as time allows. So until then, we'll see you next time. Bye.